Hello and welcome to this video. Uh, in this video I'll be showing you how to uh, install and play Daggerfall um, on DOSBox. Basically what you want to do first is you want to head to the uh, Elder Scrolls website. Up here in the games tab press Daggerfall and from on here uh, you can download the full game uh, and this is free and completely legal. Uh, this will be a zip download and uh, I'll show you that in a second and then you'll obviously also has to have to uh, download DOSBox um, which is done from their website uh, once you've downloaded DOSBox you wanna first go into uh, see if you can find uh, the DOSBox options uh, in your start menu or whatever and uh, press that now scroll down until you see the DOSBox sign here um, find the mem size uh, and if that says anything other than 32 uh, change that uh, to 32 and then save basically you can close this then uh, and then you, what you want to do is you want to locate your C drive and uh, you want to create a folder call it uh, something along the lines of DOS games uh, and in that folder folder put your uh, zip file that you have installed uh, from the Elder Scrolls website the Daggerfall one extract it here and uh, from this zip file you'll get three uh, different things you'll get the guide uh, which I'm using to show you uh, how to do this and then you'll get two different um, folders now uh, you can start actually installing Daggerfall uh, by by first uh, first what you want to do is you want to open up DOSBox once DOSBox has been opened, uh, you need to mount this folder that you've just made. Do this by writing mount c c colon backward slash uh, DOS games, and you want to write also uh, minus free size a thousand. Then that has been mounted. You also need to emulate the um, the CD uh, that Daggerfall should be running from, and by by what you want to do here is you want to write mount d c colon dos games uh, backward slash again dfcd uh, minus t cd rom minus label daggerfall there you go okay uh, now we can move on basically now you need to go to the d uh, mount you just made and write install and you will be taking to the install page. Uh, here you obviously want to press continue. Uh, you agree to the terms and then uh, install the game to your hard drive. Before doing anything here, you need to change the install size uh, to a, a huge installation. And uh, press yes, this installation size is fine once it says huge up there. Uh, and it will tell you that it's going to install it on the path below and that's fine. And uh, go ahead and install the game. And now it will be installing the game, it'll take a little while. Uh, and once that has been done, we can move on. And here we go, installation complete. Now it asks you to uh, set up your sound card, and it's important that you do this. So press yes. Um, in here, you you get uh, taken to a menu like this. Uh, press enter uh, when you're touching the auto detect button. Then press detect. Okay, and uh, it has detected the digital device Sound Blaster 16. That's an emulated device. You want to press okay. Go down to select MIDI. Uh, find the Sound Blaster 16. Press enter again. Uh, and here the port the default port is 388 and that's fine so press enter once again and go down to ok and press enter now we can go back to press enter uh, here and ok save system configuration information ok and uh, now the installation has been complete and basically then it takes you back to the commando prompt now we are not completely done yet First, what you want to do here is uh, we want to patch the the game before actually playing it. We do this by writing dag uh, two one three. This will patch the program. Press Y, 
and then press Y once again and basically BAM <laughs> it's been updated and now we can actually start the game and if everything has been done correctly you just need to write dagger uh, and press enter and the game should run like so I uh, hope you enjoyed this guide um, and uh, I hope it was helpful uh, to you. This is all I have this time uh, so please comment, rate and subscribe if you like the video and uh, other than that have a good day.